Right then, this is a quick road test video, and this is for Ford Focus uh, 1.8 ZTEC, registered BT57KNS. Mileage at the start of the road test is 114,936 miles. The reason we do these videos is essentially so that anyone that's looking at the car online um, in an advert actually gets to see it, has an opportunity to see the car in operation, and it is the very car in question. Um, it gives us an opportunity to let you know of any issues that might be in the car prior to coming to see us, which is actually more important in some ways on what we call the part exchange to clears. That basically the cars were taken as a part exchange against our main stock, which is predominantly Honda. Um, because we sell these cars at a, a price far less than their you know, perceived retail values. So we don't make any money out of them. Um, the road test is also done on these very quiet country roads, uh, very close to our premises. Not normally quite as soggy and wet, but it's been a horrendous day today, but there we are, by the by. Um, coming to the car itself, uh, car starts absolutely instantly, uh, settles to a lovely smooth, even idle. There are no warning lights on the dashboard at all relating to the engine or any other part of the car. Um, engine actually pulls really, really sweetly. It's um, I used to sell Fords many years ago. I used to work for Brown Brothers Ford um, back in the day. Um, I remember these engines well, but it just pulls very crisply, very smoothly, very quietly. Uh, temperature gauge running at pretty much half on the gauge, and it's been running for some time now, so that's pretty much exactly where it should be. There are no warning lights on the dashboard whatsoever and that relating to the engine or any other part of the car. Engine then feeds through clutch and into gearbox. Clutch on the vehicle is light, positive, um, bike points exactly where it should be, so all feels absolutely good there and fine. Likewise, gearbox, five-speed gearbox, this generation car, slick, positive. Ford always do good gearboxes in terms of kind of the way they feel. Um, the gear changes are really slick and positive and nicely weighted, and the, the linkage all feels nice and tight as well. Steering on the car, which is a massive plus point on a Ford. Uh, the, the Focus has always had a truly brilliant chassis, uh, and this is no different really. It, it basically tracks absolutely bullet straight. There's no vibrations coming back to the steering wheel. Feels nice and tight and taut on the road. It really, really does. Um, same goes to the chassis, which is just fantastic. You know, if you enjoy your driving, you'll love a Focus. They just drive brilliantly because they ride very, very comfortably beautifully damp chassis it really is a class act this um but it it just you know it just it manages to combine brilliant handling and this this fluid ride what i'm looking for in road test mechanically at least on, on the chassis is kind of any sort of major noises coming from underneath and it's the only thing on this car that i'm going to pay any note or make any note of um on the road here now, it's all silent. You don't hear anything at all. On some more pitted surfaces, there is a little bit of, um, from looks like the near side rear, passenger side rear, um, it hits sort of sharper bumps. You get a little bit of ding, 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 ding noise. So normally, but I, we know we haven't investigated it, so please don't think we have. Um, it's normally things like sort of like drop links and things like that. Um, but there is something there. Um, doesn't seem to affect the driving at all. Uh, it just, but uh, I'm being very, very critical of the car where other garages probably wouldn't even bother to mention it, but that is why we do the videos. Um, look around inside the car. Um, just squeak free rattle free feels lovely tight and taut we've not cleaned it or presented it in you know as we do our retail stock um but it's in you know it, it just needs a really good clean basically um but you know it's, it's been a well kept car brakes on the car so i should have done that first just give them a bit of a shove but really solid brake pedal on the car um lovely pedal so what i'm looking for is any kind of pulsing or vibrations coming back through the pedal when you hit the brakes hard and there's nothing at all and it pulls the car up nice and straight and true uh, which is exactly what you want on the vehicle as well so all good there coming back to the interior heater works lovely it's a horrible raw day today and the heat is on um, perfectly radio works exactly assured all the gauges everything in there working as well heated screen so obviously it's the uh, the heated screen on this model car as well um, all working exactly as as, as intended uh, but it drives very very nicely for what is a you know a very very cheap car um, and as i said before you know aside for that got a little bit of rattling from the back on pitted surfaces 
I can't really fault the driver of the car at all. It feels very, very, very tight indeed. Um, as always, though, if you've got any questions about the car, you know, don't hesitate. Do give us a call.